Hey, what's happening? Andy here with the Sports Card Life. Thanks for joining me. In today's video, I have a package back from PSA, and we're going to dig into a Gretzky Rookie PSA reveal. Before we open that up, I just want to say, please hit the subscribe and bell notifications so you catch all the upcoming videos. I sincerely appreciate if you do that. Okay, thanks. Let's get to it. Okay, super excited to open this one up because it is the Wayne Gretzky rookie. Um, had this one sent express, and uh, I'm going to take my time opening this up because of what it is. I just want to be real careful with it. Can't wait to see it. Uh, so I'll speed it ahead in the video, but I'm going to. I'm certainly going to take my time um, and be careful. Okay, while I'm opening this up, let's jump back to the previous video where I show you this card and give you my prediction. Of course, Wayne Gretzky rookie. Um, all right, so top to bottom centering is way off. Left to right, not bad. I'm not sure how much that top to bottom centering, if I, in my personal opinion in purchasing a card, if I had to choose whether the centering was off top to bottom, left to right, much better eye appeal in my opinion to have it off centered top to bottom. Still gonna hurt the grade. Corners aren't bad, like not perfect corners on it. There is some minimal wear there. Let's see the back here. So you can get a good look at that. All right, so my prediction, a six would be would be brilliant. Probably, probably stretching, dreaming there a little bit. Uh, a five would be, would be happy for sure. Uh, it might be a PSA four. I'd say, if I was to bet on it, I'd say probably a four. Uh, hoping for a five, would be happy with a five. Uh, if this came back a PSA three, I'd be I'd be a bit shocked even with the centering. It's it's because it's got such nice color, uh, really nice eye appeal. Um, PSA four, my prediction on it. Get a look in there. See how they send a single graded card. There we go. Without further ado. Wow, that looks nice. As I initially said in the video, but then during that time, and we all know how long and how uh, how swamped PSA got with their submissions, during that time it seemed like they were grading this card harsher and harsher. And after seeing some of uh, other people's cards come back, graded a five, grade to six, then I thought it's most likely a four, almost certain it was a four, hoping for the five and uh, that was exactly the case it's a four what you'll see what knocks it down is the centering but it's off center top to bottom more so than left to right which i find not as uh, i i think it has better eye appeal if it's going to be off center be better for it to be off center top to bottom than left to right um corners are okay especially given the year and uh vintage card but that bottom Bottom right there probably has more of a, a little little bend than a than a nick, but you can see the corners, a little bit of white, a little bit of wear, not bad. Pretty sharp on the back. That, ladies and gentlemen, is is what is current PSA very good to excellent graded a four. Love it though, looks sharp. Okay, folks, that wraps up this video. Thanks very much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already done so, and hit the bell notification so you don't miss any of the upcoming content. Also, you might want to check out my previous video, First PSA Submission Part 1, and I give you my predictions on all 35 cards submitted.